So the first thing is you go to the website here. Click it here, Todd. Here? Uh, over here. Oh, this one? Yeah. Oh, so what we're gonna do right now, the steps right now is to load the driver. So you go to support, okay, hover it, printer driver, and you get what is the printer driver you want. For now, we get the 7890. So we're already here, right? So when you click 7890, it goes here. Then from here, you go down. So you go to the, the you go here. So you make sure that the operating system is, what is your operating system? Like Windows 10, Windows 11. So with that, it is, this is Windows 10, right? I can mm -hmm. see, it's 11 or 10? I think I it's think 11. It's... I think 11. I think you're 11. Because the normal is here, the center. Are you not sure? Uh, and uh, detected, so can you bring it down? So there's 11. Click can you it. try to check it here? Click this one. So this one we have to make sure that. Uh, what is your windows here? Uh, where to go there? We have to make sure what windows you have. Uh, my update, let us try update here. Maybe check for updates, yeah. So system, go here to the system. And this is, what windows is this? I think this is 11. The way it looks here. 11 so this is windows 11 so okay go close that one you need to update that okay okay so when here he detected windows 10 but you are not windows 10 it should be 11 so you have to go to 11 yeah you go to driver ah go no sorry go go first windows 11 okay then download supposedly go here to driver and download so that's the most important part you need to verify like what windows are you okay so he detected windows 10 but actually you are not windows 10 you're windows 11 okay. then after that you open it's a very straightforward so okay then unzip then okay Say yes. And that's the date 90, right? Okay. Then okay. It's all okay, okay. <laughs> Accept. It's a very straightforward. So we'll just wait for the process. Then install. Then this will be done like automatically okay. it's done how many percent 88 percent okay so it says here Epson okay just say okay oh oh no I think we go back no, we cancel that so printer driver installation and port convert Completely successful. Okay. okay so Close that one too. Yeah. Close that one. All right. So, so we go here to check if we do the right thing. Setting. Where's that setting? Setting. Okay. Then Bluetooth and devices. Then you go to the printers and scanner. And now you can see the Epson 7890. So if you click this one, you see it's uh, idle. So okay. it means everything is done. Good. Now. Close that one. So the next step is to install the Acro Rip. So you go here again to Macloud website over here. Then you go to support. Then download. Then depending to what Acro Rip you have, you have Acro Rip 10. So you go to 10. Then it started to download. Okay. okay. <laughs> That's very straightforward. <laughs> Then open, we'll take, and 
yes next install so here you're gonna learn to print in a matter of one hour okay if you buy the chinese printer you need one week to learn uh we start anyway we start yeah so it is starting so this is the beauty of this uh setup because you know epson you know like you just Printing a DTF is like printing an ordinary document. Mm -hmm. If you are using an Epson printer, if you are using a different printer, oh my God. That's why some other says that we will go to your place, we stay there for three days, teach you how to install. And uh, the problem, if you have a problem with the printer, then if you buy the printer in Alibaba, then you have to wake, you have to yeah. wake up at nine o'clock in the evening because it's nine o'clock in china yeah. so if you end up five o'clock and the bad the bad thing is like this so you are starting to work it's like okay we're still starting our office we will start about 10 o'clock so you start at 10 o'clock right when it reaches 12 o'clock midnight it's like oh it's our break time town break time so you have to wait one hour and okay. and they will come back at one o'clock or 1 30 and you start working again until five o'clock in the afternoon and you have to do that like until the problem was resolved so, yeah. oh my god that's a lot so i experienced that i have access to the best printer in other countries but uh i refuse to sell it so he will do the there's a lot of updating that he's doing so while we do that while we're doing this so we've done already the first step of the initial field right so you do the second one do it again there menu and Sorry. enter yeah so that when we're done here when we're done here it's done already too okay so after this the next step after we install the upper rip is uh i think the next step is how to configure the the acro rip but it seems like updating, it will take so much time. So let's stop this video and we will continue the next episode. <laughs>